while the rest of the world is sleeping, you are wide awake. And you are on the attack for your success. It doesn't start with them and they. It starts with me. So I'm just wondering when you're gonna make it personal. Are you really prepared to grind it out? Everybody wants public authority, but nobody wants private discipline. Your habits change behind the scenes. When your private life begins to shift, when you put aside the things that are not serving you, if it's going to be personal, make it personal. Don't just be great in public, be great in private. Success doesn't always have to be loud. Sometimes it's necessary to be quiet and just move. Are you really prepared to do what you need to do to get what you want out of your life? You gotta live. You have to breathe. You have to eat this purpose. Every single day, you are either losing ground or gaining ground. You are not going to win anything until you understand what struggle means. You can never quit. But you gotta walk hard in silence. You gotta walk when nobody's watching. You gotta sacrifice behind the scenes. When you take it personal, your private life changes. Success. It's a process. The process comes before success. The struggle comes before the process. Everybody wants to contribute to destiny, but nobody wants to be committed to destiny. What kind of work are you putting in behind the scenes? What can you conquer in the dark? How personal is your purpose? This is what we call grinding in silence. Not everyone needs to understand your true motives. Not everyone needs to understand your purpose. Not everyone needs to understand your mission. But the truth is, it's about passion. It's about discipline. It's about awareness. It's about accountability. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, you got to be accountable for your actions. But are you prepared to grind it out? Are you prepared to dig a little bit deeper? Are you prepared to fight a little bit harder? Are you prepared to put in overtime? Somewhere along the line, you lost your footing, you lost your place. It got cold. Too cold for you. And see, one thing about an achiever, it's rain, sleep, or snow, they keep building. But you have not sacrificed, you have not suffered, you are not committed. When you are committed, you give everything you have. Every single week, every single day, every single hour, every single minute, 720 hours a month, you are beating on your craft, even when you're at work, you're dreaming, you're thinking, you're vision casting, you're writing it down, making it play, communicating to your destiny connections so that it can become a reality. You can sleep in your head, you can hold it in your hands, but the question I want to ask you is, are you committed? Now it's time to grind. Now it's time to fight. Now it's time to believe. Now it's time to know that your success story has to be told. Don't sit back and have a pity party. Don't sit back and wait for an opportunity to happen. 
It is up to you to go out there and get the opportunities. You want success? Then go get it. You want to be better? Then be better. You want something more than what you have right now? Then you got to have the desire within your heart and go strong and go with everything you have. I don't know who I'm talking to. I don't know what you've been called to do, what you've been called to accomplish, what you've been destined to build, who you've been called to be connected to, but the dots will connect. Every single moment that you have is an opportunity of a lifetime. Are you committed? Or are you just contributing? The choice is yours. But this time, make it personal. Hear my voice. Know that you do have some work to do. The work that you do will determine the outcome in the end. But do it in silence. The ones that need to be a part of your development, they will always be there. And the ones that doubted you, I'm talking about the naysayers, just simply say, shh, be quiet, because you have nothing. give 110 percent and get to a point where all you got to say is you don't have nothing to do with my success the noise that you making can't stop my purpose the noise that you making can't stop my fight the noise that you making can't stop my grind your noise is just empty it means nothing to my success. I didn't get it overnight. And yes, I had many sleepless nights. And I had amazing dreams of what I could do. Watch yourself. Can you condition yourself? Come on, can you believe again? Can you see it again? Can you write again? Can you make this thing personal? That it doesn't start with the people connected to you. It starts with you. It doesn't even start with your past. It starts with where you are and where you're going. Can you look ahead? Can you stretch forth? Can you condition yourself? Can you prepare yourself for the next thing? Come on, make it personal. But you gotta work hard and challenge. You gotta take it personal. I make this thing personal. So while you're sitting around, second guessing yourself, my beautiful people, get back on your grind, be productive, keep your head up high, stay in the moment, live every moment.